Greetings from Bishop Fenwick. Welcome back to this edition of Tuesdays with Tom. That's going out not only to our current students and families, but to all of our alumni and friends in the greater Fenwick family. Today, I share with you three C's in response to COVID-19. Three C's, something to celebrate, something to create, and something to comfort. First, something to celebrate. I'm in the foyer between the gym on my right and the auditorium on my left, and this gorgeous new meeting space behind me. And what a beautiful space it is. What a beautiful space it would have been to host our Night at the Arts for Bishop Fenwick just a few short weeks ago. Of course, because of coronavirus, we're not able to do that. But don't give up hope, because we are celebrating the arts at Bishop Fenwick this Friday at 6 p.m. Students in our visual and performing arts programs will share with you their amazing talent, their extraordinary work. Come join us, the whole community celebrating the arts here at Bishop Fenwick at six o'clock via the Zoom link found in this email. Something to celebrate. Something to create. What's your experience of coronavirus been like? It's a universal reality and yet a very unique experience, right? It's a global pandemic but it's touched each of us in very personal, private ways. I wondered how it's been for you. And to give us an opportunity to share that, I offered this. A few decades ago, Ernest Hemingway apparently was having lunch with some fellow authors, and he bet them that he could come up with the story in only six words. They all put their 10 bucks on the table, and legend has it, no real proof, that Hemingway scribbled six words on the back of a napkin, passed it around, and then collected his winnings. On the back of a napkin, these words. For sale, baby shoes, never worn. I'm not going to dwell on the haunting nature of that six word story. I simply use it as an illustration that six words can say a lot. Six words can tell a great deal about what is it that you're trying to describe. And I'm curious, what's your experience of COVID-19? So email me a six word story to six word stories at Fenwick.org. That's six word stories, all one word, six word stories at Fenwick.org. What's your six word story gonna be? Mine might be eight weeks since my last haircut. Ooh, not good. Yeah, six words. Okay, and finally, a little bit of comfort, right? We all feel a, a bit uncertain and unsteady these days, all looking for some kind of uh, grace, perhaps, to guide us through. And so I share with you this beautiful piece of music written by uh, Father Michael Jonkis, who apparently just a few short weeks ago in response to COVID-19, woke up in the middle of the night with his inspiration for this beautiful piece of music, and in a few short hours, the lyrics were done, the music was composed, and this is what we have. I shared it at our morning meeting this morning. I hope it uh, brings you a sense of peace and comfort, a feeling of being sheltered. Have a great day and a wonderful week. Take care.